back inside Arizona Daily Mix on this Wednesday. We're going to be talking about biz, besties, and brunch. This is so cool. I love when you come on the show. This is Tisha Marie Pelletier. She is the president, not just the owner and president. founder, but the president <laughs> of Tisha Marie Enterprises. Nice to have you back. Thanks oh, for coming. It's good to be back. You always bring some good stuff and great information. I try. <laughs> because you're so busy and you have a lot of things that you're doing, especially to help you know entrepreneurs. Mm -hmm. This is another one of your fantastic events, but before we get to that, I want people to know a little bit about the work you do and who you are so they can utilize your services. Yes. So as you know, I love working with startups. Uh -huh. I'm sure that last time I was on. So I am a startup business mentor. So yeah. I love helping people who are ready to take the entrepreneurial mm -hmm. leap just get going and build that solid foundation for their business and yes. have a little fun. I know, but that's what you do. And you create these um, events that get people out and about so they can network. Right. Meet other people that are doing just what they're doing because it can be a daunting task trying to start your own business. It can be. So these events are a great way to network. Mm -hmm. And you don't even know you're networking because you're having so much fun right. and you're also experiencing some things out here in the valley too. So we're going to be talking about biz, which is the business, the yes. besties, because you have your best friends there or you meet some new friends who exactly. can become your besties and always got to have some food in there with uh, the brunch, right? And dessert. All right, a little sweet tea. <laughs> there we go. So let's tell everybody a little bit about this and the benefits of it. Yeah, so biz, besties, and brunch, this is the second year mm -hmm. I'm doing this and it really kicks off at the Japanese Friendship Garden because a lot of people have so Pretty. Oh, I love the invitation. Yeah. Look how cute so this is there. a this is a shot of the Japanese Friendship Garden from last year. But I it's so relaxing there. This is why I say I'm yes. like this is a chance to get uh -huh. in the Zen for your weekend and right. meet some great women. So I feel that are a lot of new faces coming this year because mm -hmm. they're like, oh yes, please. How do I get out and still network and be productive, mm -hmm. but take some time for me? So right. I'm always about bringing self care into the mix. So at this event, we've got an organic catered brunch with um, Chef Jennifer, and then mm -hmm. we've got desserts from Alexa Bakes and a Ooh. lot of pampering so henna glittery tattoos little satin hands and some nails going on you thought of everything I do I'm like let's just roll out all the punches well you've been doing this for time. a while as I love on your website you have that big title stop the struggle because it doesn't have to be a struggle especially if you're following your passion exactly mm -hmm. exactly and I think that there are a lot more people stepping outside of that comfort zone leaving the cubicle and that's traditional nine to five mm -hmm. and really trying to find something that that is a niche for them so they can thrive in their own happiness. I think the thing is though, Danielle, that a lot of people when they go into entrepreneur mode, mm -hmm. it really is isolating. It you're is. fine. Like if you're a solopreneur, you're working on all the stuff on your on mm -hmm. your own. So you need to have things like this, events right. like this where you get out, you kind of get back to center mm -hmm. and you meet new people and that's how your business will start to thrive because you're able to connect and collaborate with other people. This is going to be a lot of fun. You're going to so have a lot of fun. people. So is it still open for people to come it, or are you like sold still, out? Uh, it's still <laughs> open. So today, um, probably by 8 p.m., I'm going to be closing registration. But okay. people can still register and use code SUNSHINE nice. for $5 off to mm -hmm. come on down and have a great time with us. And for people that, you know, traditionally go to a regular networking where it is sometimes all business, what would you recommend for them if this is their first time, especially if they've just jumped into that entrepreneurial boat? Well, definitely wear a sun hat. Right. <laughs> Look at how cute these ones Sun hat, got. sundress, no heels. It really is a chance for you just mm -hmm. come as you are be comfortable smile a lot make some great friends make some great connections mm -hmm. I'm always about having people feel be feel very welcome when they come to right. any event that I host so I feel that that's just a natural environment for them to thrive anyway there's not this I need to impress people like <laughs> right. I'm wearing just one of these guard down a little bit. exactly exactly so really about building authentic connections mm -hmm. and doing it in a way where we're having fun and getting in the Zen well, we got about 30 seconds so I want you to tell people what you have coming up besides this because you have a lot of Yes. workshops that people can take advantage of? I do. Well, I was sharing with you that my book, I was on in February. I um, know. So the book just came out on Audible. Look at Audible. you go. It's You're on, on Kindle, on Amazon. On Kindle. Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> that came out. And then I also booked my summer self-care spa retreat. So that's coming oh, up good. July 14th. I was on last year talking about mm -hmm. it. And that will be at the Scottsdale Plaza. And it's a full day of self-care, yoga, brunch, cocktails, you name it. It's a great time. Get in the Zen with Tisha. <laughs> she will help you out. Tisha Marie Pelletier is the name. So Tisha Marie Enterprises.com. We also have a link on our website, aztv.com. Right now, we're going to check in with Sandy and see what she has going on.